Hi everybody, welcome back to another video. It's Speedy Blue Dragon here and today I am gonna be so I'm gonna have to tell you one of the top six dangerous hackers on Roblox. Why did I make this video? Because I'm trying to keep you safe and I don't wanna make um, fake videos of hackers. I don't wanna make videos of fake hackers. Yeah, but I will prove to you if they're fake. Alright, guys. So we're going to get through of the top six uh, really dangerous hackers on Roblox. So before we get into this video, I want you guys to subscribe and click the bell and send notification squad. And hit that and share the video and hit that. If you like it or not, hit the like button. Alright guys, so let's get right into this video. <clears throat> so, number six. Fastbucks.me It's a really dangerous website. On YouTube, everybody was saying that it was a scam. Like, that happened before the those videos. When it all started, it was saying that on Roblox groups servers and video game roblox games and it'll keep happening and it says somebody said, said that some of the people with no robux got some free robux yeah and you just find them on rob uh, find their profile that means somebody made them and it's a lot and then you just have to um put your password and username in and to sign up to get some free robux but it's a lie it's a scam hey jack what what do parakeets like to eat what kind of veggies fruit i don't know new research they need to eat healthier mm. check on mm -hmm. your computer when you're done okay all right sorry for that my mom didn't even let me talk to the video so yeah, and do not trust the fastbucks.me, and it's keep appearing everywhere in games, servers, yeah, and groups. Yeah, because it's in the um, Roblox, yeah, and it's controlling it. Like it said the same thing and all of the white stuff in Roblox. Like, I've seen that in servers and my group. I thought there was so many he hackers in my group. I mean, so many scammers in my group. Yeah. And then, when the when that scammer got banned, then the video showed up, said that, don't trust fastbucks.me. Yeah, they were right. I know that'll happen. I knew it. I did not trust fastbucks.me. And then, next... The next one is RBX dot center. Yeah, and it was back. It was saying it hit everywhere. And it was back. Yeah, but be yeah, but Fastbuck stopped me. He yeah, was keep creating no new accounts be so he because every time he gets banned he creates a new account. And he never gets banned, but yeah. And I don't know why did he stop saying that anymore, but he's still saying Arabic BX set dot center on my group. And there's keep there's always fast bucks stop me. And I don't know how can that scammer get banned. That's the yeah. That's a really dangerous hacker. All right. Next one, number five, John Doe. So John Doe was a testing account for Roblox. Yeah, so when, yeah, so when everybody was new and got their own Robux by buying them, and then nobody wasn't on John Doe's account, but somebody was. And then they have, then, the name was John Doe, and then there was Jane Doe, and they said that they're gonna, uh, sh they're gonna um hack people on Roblox in March 18th, 
2017. Like I've seen that. I joined Roblox in 2016. Never, I never heard about him when I joined in 2016. Yeah, but now it was 2017. It all started. Then when it was March 18th, I stopped playing it on March 18th. Then when it was not March 19th, I started playing. I passed March 18th, so I didn't get hacked. But I found out that John Doe, the answer is fake. Yeah, but, I, no, wait, wait, I forgot the number six. RB, RBX Center or, or fast, B, fast Buck Stop Me must be real or fake. I don't know. I will just have to figure out how to prove it. All right, guys? But the answer is real. All right, guys? I think it is, guys. Yeah, okay, guys. So, we're going to number four. Her. All right. I don't remember what his name is. Yeah, but it's a kid. Roblox was shut down in April 1st, 2012. I wasn't... I didn't join Roblox yet. I was still a little kid. I was born in 2008. Yeah, guys. So Roblox shut down in 2012, March 1st. Yeah, and then everything was unshut down, and then everything was supposed to be on Roblox in in catalog, and it's not supposed to be on there. So, oh, so they fixed everything on Robux. On Roblox, they fixed everything as they can with their own programming skills. Then they fixed the whole thing. They found out who was, and the people thought it was just a big fat prank. Yeah, but it was not a prank. It was real. It's just a spoiled kid that's a hacker. Her, he just shut down Roblox on March on April one first, two thousand twelve. A long time ago. Yeah, it's just that kid did that. And then on Nixter Feed 2018, he was trying to prove that that kid shut down Roblox on 2012 in April 1st. But Nixter Feed proved it that that was the real kid just shut down Roblox. Yeah, and then. It was the real kid that just shut down Roblox on 2012. And then he said that he's going to unban 1x1x1x1. Yes. And x1. 1x1. Yeah. I don't know how, to, I don't know how many times am I going to say it. Yeah, so... Let's go ahead to number three. One X, one X, one X, one X. I'm trying to say it slow because I don't want to say it too fast because I might say it five times, so I gotta say it four times. That's his some um, character's name, yeah. I never heard about him before, but that's John those friend. Yeah. But guys, oh shoot, I forgot on number four. That was the real on number four. Let's go back to number four right now. Yeah, so that kid shut down Roblox on 2012, April 1st. And the answer is real. All right, guys. So let's go back to number three. He on Roblox, everybody doesn't even know about him. It was just a new account. Yeah, I don't know how to... Yeah, and he uh, hack. He might hack people, and he was causing a threat to Roblox. I don't. I don't even know, remember what is he about. Yeah, but it was just a fake hacker, guys. It's just fake. The answer is fake. So let's go ahead. Head to number two. All right. Eat the blocks. Watch. A lot of the people oh, in 2017, I've heard about him, and the Blocks Watch said he's gonna, if anybody is gonna target people to hack them. And then some of the YouTubers, 
uh, record videos of the blocks watch and the blocks watch just watch their videos and then they got mad then they just target them to hack them like they're targeting Dennis Alex and I don't know and Poke and Pringley those are my favorite youtubers yeah guys yeah and I don't know what else yeah but then and the, those YouTubers were scared that their target by the blocks watch. And yeah, so that was pretty scary of them, but they found out why their target. So then the blocks watch was watching them for the whole time. But we're gonna have to prove this. The answer is fake. Yeah, like Nixter V doesn't make videos of the Blocks Watch anymore because the Blocks Watch was fake and he didn't want to record her the videos of Why fake hackers. Yeah, guys, so let's go ahead and number one. And Project Sorgo. Project Sorgo is a new hacker in 2018. And he must be real or fake. And uh, I don't, I don't even know how to prove it, but I, I think I believe that. So then, when on Roblox, one of the people who saw that uh, there's a team of Project Sorgo is gonna hack people, and I don't know when are they gonna hack people, but then. They let it, it uh, Seth plays Panda join the Project Sorgo. Like, I don't want to join them. Yeah. Yeah, so they forced uh, Seth plays Panda to join in the Project Sorgo because if they, they didn't for, if uh, Seth plays then he joined the team, he might um, get hacked. But if he joins the team, his username gets changed. And then, and his outfit gets wrong and gets like the Project Sorgo. And nobody doesn't want it. And there's four videos of the Project Sorgo. Oh, guys. On the Project Sorgo's YouTube channel. And on the video, they said that they're gonna target uh, Sandink, Sandink, and Nixter Fee, and I don't know, I don't even know what his name is. Yeah, but Nixter Fee is my favorite YouTuber. Yeah, and then they said they're gonna target him to target them to hack them. Because they were mad of anger. The boss was mad and he wanted to get, so he wanted to hack them because they've been pulling, a, they've been pretending to be Project Sorgos and try and, and prank them. Alright, guys? And nobody doesn't even know why is the Project Sorgo doing this, like why is there dangerous hackers on Roblox, why is there so many, so the answer is real, guys, like that's, that doesn't scare me at all, alright guys, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video, leave a comment below, and I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Bye, and peace out, guys.